What is going on, everybody? Dan on Filter checking out the Unguided Phoenix Down. The Unguided. That's one of those band names you could feel. I like that one. I like that one. They are also a Swedish band. I just did like my five seconds of half assed internet research. Another one. We're up to, I think we're up to, it's 25 or 26. That is bananas. That's that's absurd. And this comes from Patreon. Maddie Dubs, appreciate you as always, homie. Hit me up right there if you guys have any requests. Let's check out the unguided. That is absurd though. Like when you think about it, how the hell are there over 20? Different. It's not like that 20 reactions. No, no, no. 20 reaction to 20 different Swedish bands. Sweden isn't that big. Oh. Okay. In this big panorama of lies, wish we came to call life. I'm robbing everything to find the fire that you need. When it first started, and the guitars were going in, I was like, okay, maybe this isn't a Swedish metal band. Because it, it felt, the atmosphere felt lighter. I was like, this might be, you know, like a Swedish theory of a dead man type of thing going on. And then the, the singer started singing. I'm like, okay, yeah, it feels more like that. And then the other singer came in. All right, it, it might be a metal band. It's like heavy rock slash metal more than just pure metal, for sure. At least this song. It feels kind of like a, a Swedish bullet for my valentine type of thing. Or I've only heard a couple Atreyu songs, but kind of like a, what I've heard from Atreyu, where it's metal light. It sounds great, but you know what I mean? It's like, I don't want to call it like, oh, oh Swedish metal. I love that they're singing over each other, like completely. They're both doing their parts, like as if the other guy didn't exist. <laughs> That's fantastic. Also, could you could you find a band with two more opposite male singers? Not just not just the way they sound, the way they look, the way they're dressed, the whole the whole vibe they give off. Complete opposites. Like I wouldn't even expect them to know each other in real life. What do you got?
this Holy shit. That song just kept getting better. It started as alright, it's pretty good. Harsh vocalist came in. Okay. Okay. And then about the halfway point, it really took a leap forward. They really just kept using the uh the harsh vocalist and him just they basically sang the whole second half of the song together. But not together. Like oh, over one overrunning each other. I almost want to look at the lyrics of both parts and see if you just took one of them away. Would the song be perfectly fine? Like, did they need each other? I mean, for this to be just a a song? I think I think you could have two separate songs. And then just have, like, if I, if this was, if I was the manager of the band, I would say, hey, remove one singer and do it, then do the other one. That's two songs. And then release the third. With, which would be this, with both together, both parts at the same time. I think it would blow people's fucking minds. Three, two songs and one in the third song. It's kind of a rip-off, but I'm, I'm here for it. Also, this angle, when he was hitting the solo and they went to this camera angle right here, where you can the camera's on the uh, guitar. How, the, how come more people aren't using that angle? For a solo, that would be fucking sweet for so many solos and so many music videos. Like, this solo was okay. It was nothing special, though. It was all right. But this camera angle on an absolute heater, like a, a flamethrower of a solo? Sign me up. I want to see it. I want to see it. I don't know why I haven't seen this angle before. If I have, it's only been like once or twice. I, this needs to be a kind of common thing. It's 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 a really awesome shot, but overall, the unguided, pretty sweet. I will say the most tame, I guess. Which that's 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 telling you something. This was tame, in terms of heaviness of the, all the Swedish bands. This is on the probably the most tame ish tame level. It really was. Now the, the uh, final third, all hell kind of broke loose. The, the drummer went full double pedal. Everything was a perfect storm. I love when that happens in songs. It's hard to kind of beat that musically. It's just it's a fucking tornado of sound. It's great. It's great. I enjoyed it. Hit like Phoenix Down. I'm assuming they're not talking about the city. They must be talking about the bird since they're Swedish. See, my guess, my guess, they're talking about the bird. And if you are still here, I wonder if they have the song that says, that's called, like, Phoenix Rises. Like, this is the first part. Phoenix goes down, and the Phoenix has to rise. It's what the fucking bird does. It's all he's known for. A real one. 